All right, people, what the hell is going on? It is time for Let's Scroll and React. And so that's when I just go up and down. I'm just on Facebook now. I'm not on um, on Twitter or nothing. I might, I might switch over. It depends on what I run across on here. Um, I'm going to start right here. This guy here, this fucker right here. Let me see. Where my my little button at? Y'all can see this old Montel Williams looking like right here. Him. What the hell does he do? Doctor, whatever the fuck his name is. What's his name? Dr. Farah? That actually says Farah to me, but I don't think he pronounced it like that. That dude, what, do, what does he do? Because I see these videos that he posts, like this one right here, and it's, it's just him sitting there. I never, I never actually see this man say shit other than watch this. And at the end of the video, he don't have no commentary or nothing on what the fuck. I, I, I don't, I don't, you know, I, I don't know. It's just, I, I don't need his face right there. You know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't need his face right there. But we're going to start off on this video right here. I'm going to leave my little zoom thing up here because talk back is, that's the only bad thing about having it up there. We're going to start with this video right here. Because this is the first thing I run across. And we're going to have a listen. And all this shit is dumb. So we're going to see what's going on here. What are you talking about? What you mean what I'm talking about? You know what I'm talking about? Why you quit your job? Because I wasn't going to pay bills anymore. I don't want to do any of this anymore. What you mean you're not going to pay bills? I think this is an eight minute I'm long video. I'm not paying any bills anymore. Like, are you hard of hearing? Like, so, I'm not doing it anymore. So you're not going to help me out of my Oh. Why? Because that's your job. You're supposed to be paying all the bills in the first place. Why I got to go work? Why I got to get up at 8 o'clock? Who house is this? It's our house. But you going to pay all these bills. I'm not doing it by myself. I'm saying, so what's wrong with you working and helping? There's a lot wrong with it. Why I got to do it? Why not do it? You sit up here and act like you the man of the house. Okay, be the man of the house and pay all the bills. I'm not doing it. I am the man of the house. No, you're not. You're no, you're not. Not complaining like that. No, I'm not the man of the like house. That. The man of the house telling you you need it. No, I'm not going to do anything. I'm going to continue to do what I'm doing right here on my computer, and you go to work. And what you doing on you the computer, y'all? You go to work. You doing doing the kids. Be a man. Doing. Step up and do what you need to do. I always been a man. No, you're not. No, I you're not. Been you don't have been lately. Been a man. You sure haven't been lately. How? So what? How? You bring this camera in my face to do what? How? What the point show, are you trying show, to prove? To show people how sorry you is. I'm That's not sorry. What, how about I'm that? not sorry. What how I'm gonna do that? is be the lady in the house and make sure the house is taken care of, and you go out and work. How come I don't? Did you just eat last night? What the, Did you just eat last night? Tell them what, what the point is. Tell them what you cook me. The point is, I'm not gonna go and work for nobody anymore. <laughs> now you can cook? go and work at your little warehouse job and bring back that money <laughs> so we can pay these bills. Cooking rotel ain't no. What you talking about? We're not even talking about me cooking. What we talking about is you going to work so you can come back home and make sure that we good. No, what we talking about is you need to go get a job so you can no, help I'm make sure we good. No, I'm not gonna do anything. I'm not about to do anything. If you are not satisfied, no, we need to help make sure each other good. So like, no, I'm, I'm good. I'm thing. good. You need to make sure that this whole house. Is you good. good? Yeah, I'm good. How you good if you just quit your job? Because you don't know what I got put up. But at the end of the day, like I said, I'm not paying. Oh. So that's what we doing. Like I said, I'm not paying anything else. And you, you and you're gonna be responsible for everything else. I'm tired of paying bills. Simple as that. So what you wanna do? Bro, that little portion you put in on portion? Dude, that little portion. Okay, so that my little portion about do... nothing, because I'm not paying anything else. And why? that's the problem. I'm not understanding that. You understand why you don't think that's a problem? It isn't a problem. So I'm, I'm you your wife. I'm your wife. So why do you want your wife to go out and work? I'm not understanding it. Plenty of people wise work. Okay, I'm not gonna be one of them anymore. Simple as that. Hold no. on, let me let me pause this shit because this right here, both of these motherfuckers, at this point in this whole relate, look, this goddamn thing is only it's eight minutes, and it's only two minutes and forty three minutes in. I'm end up skipping this shit, but they deserve each other. They husband and wife, and this is a argument that they're having that she quit her fucking job because she just don't want to pay bills anymore you know what i'm saying 
she just she just don't want to pay bills anymore. He upset, which is understandably so, because apparent. I mean, but how do you not have this whole dynamic worked out beforehand? What was y'all doing before y'all got married? And I don't know how long they've been married, but what the what what's really going on? You know what I'm saying? What, what's really going on the way this is a problem? And how are they living to where one person could just quit their goddamn job and expect for one person to just pay all the bills and still maintain, you know what I'm saying, whatever little lifestyle. You can't see nothing but a wall back there. And um, this one of them things where, uh, where I'm just thinking that Okay, she got whatever she got going on. She quit her job. She probably quit her job, but she got she probably got some kind of hustle over there. You know what I'm saying? She probably got some kind of hustle over there. And just from my men's intuition, she probably fucking somebody else to start with. You know what I'm saying? I'm just that's just in my head. You know what I'm saying? If that if that stay if that stay home life, she got something else going on. She not counting on that. Whatever it is going on in that in that that little domicile, she not counting on that. You know what I'm saying? She she got something somewhere else. Oh, you need to step your game up, go get you another job, go get two, three, four, five, six more if you got to. But you, I'm not gonna do it no more. I do not nah, you got go me. being lazy, stop being a bomb. Nah. And go get another job. Nah, nah, but you can't do You can get up off and go get you another me. job because you quit nah, a job I'm, that's I'm straight. I'm straight at the end of the day. You, Megan, need to go get you another job and take care of these bills. We got four, we got four kids and you can't even barely take care of Hold one. Hold on, wait, wait, wait a They got four kids? Four? This is some shit that she doing and they got Four? Four? I don't know if they all his, but four? You married this dumb bitch. What the fuck? You know what I'm saying? What kind of pussy she got between her goddamn legs? It, it, it gotta be some wonderful shit. It gotta be some wonderful shit. Because this broad had to been stupid before you start talking to her. It, she just had to be. I, it just, this is beyond me. This is beyond me. No, that's a lie. That's a lie. First, so, what, how much, not gonna lie to how much money you bring home? You're not gonna lie to you. How me. much money you bring home? I'm not gonna lie to you. All right, I'm so, not gonna discuss so therefore, my funds. I'm not, I'm not gonna discuss I'm my not funds for the world. And I'm job. not gonna lie. I'm not working another job. Simple yeah. as that. Bro, see, see this? What? I have to go through y'all. You You're not this going because you have Man up. Man up. Man up. Man up. Man up, Man up and do what? Go get you another go job. Go get another job. Get your job stressed. And if that ain't enough, go get another one. Since it ain't paying you enough, go get you another job. Stop being lazy. Like I said. I'm being lazy. Yep. Says the person sitting on hey, the line. Says your wife. Right? I guarantee you probably so, shot on, so on the line right now. Okay, and I probably am. And with my money. And? With our money. No, with my money. See, that's your problem. See, yeah, see, that's that shit right money. there. That'll you get your ass put the fuck up out of my house right with. there. Do you see what I'm dealing with? That'll end Nothing. up getting your ass kicked the fuck Nothing, out. Because I'm not going to be stressed out listening to you. Stressed Go out. to work. You stressed out? I'm the stressed out. You stressed out about what? I'm the out. Because you barely do anything, Auntie. Barely do anything. Barely. Come on, barely. Come on. Barely. Come on. Um, see, now, this is what. How you going to say that he need to pay all the bills? And then you quit your job and then go say that he don't do shit. Well, if he don't do shit, how are you able to just stop fucking working? You know what I'm saying? How the fuck are you able to do this? Oh man, I, I'm way too far into this guy. This is the first goddamn. I, I had to scroll here. Work yet. for anybody else again. As, as, as long as I'm your wife, as long as I'm your wife, I'm not working for nobody else. So you either gonna have to divorce me or go get you some more jobs. So big. So and you're not going nowhere. So therefore, go get so you some big, more jobs. So big, we need to get a divorce. We're not I'm not getting no more jobs. Yes, you are. I'm not getting yes, no more jobs. Getting fifteen dollars. You suggest this shit. Side, I co signed it right then. Go job, double it. Go double it. Go double it. See, you know I wouldn't work for nobody like that. You know what I'm saying? Selfish. Therefore, you need to get your money. Selfish. I'm dealing with a selfish wife who don't care about nobody but herself. Okay. I broke up with a girlfriend because of being I'm selfish. If you quit your job, you don't even care about your kids because you want to get you another job. You over here being a lazy. Nobody wants to be a lazy 
bum. You, you barely work a full time job. Bro, you I work a full time job, bro. What's a 12 hour shift? You don't work no 12 hours, bro. I work 10 to 12 hour shifts. The, the money ain't coming. I work coming. 10 to the 12 hour shifts. The money not coming. I'm not working again. What you mean the money not coming? It go to the bills. Money. Nah. It no. go to bills. It barely even cover the bills. So therefore, like I said, the, it barely. for the last time, it barely. for the last time, I'm not going to go work for nobody else again. Go get another job. You gonna go all the way I'm not that? gonna fall nowhere. Yeah, you gonna you fall. You gonna fall. fall. You gonna fall. What? You are. Hey. You are. Yeah, you. You been, I you. fell as soon as I married you. I fell off. You been what? As soon as I, I married you. you, I fell off. I paid for everything. I wet him everything, and I, I paid for the count. That's cap. That's how lazy That's you are. I gotta do everything for them. You will be lying. You're lazy and you're selfish. You'll be lying. She lazy and selfish. Okay. And that's why she went and did with the okay. quit her job. And that's. I, and and I, I just want to lie and put her home too long. I just can't hold what, what. I don't care. Up the street. It? Up the street somewhere. Up street. Up street. See what I'm saying? Do y'all have to deal with, 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 do you think this is right that I have to deal, that I have to put up with a job and don't cook? Do you think I gotta sit here and put up with a man who get paid Bro $15 tape. an hour and don't bring no money home to where I gotta be stash, where I gotta be stash to help you, oh, so you out? Stash. So you refuse to so go get another job? Yeah, so you gotta stash? That's kind of shit right there. You know, what's, what's yours is mine and what's mine is mine. Uh-uh, that, uh, uh, that shit don't work. Not not in my book, not about I'll be single for the rest of my life. As soon as I see something like that, I'm out. I am out. Like all this shit he doing right here. This shit he doing. He's sitting there arguing and all this other shit. I'm just out. You know what I'm saying? I would the next thing she hear from me would be with some with some papers in my hand. It wouldn't even be no goddamn discussion. It wouldn't be no discussion at all. This whole goddamn whole phone in the face shit is irritating as fuck on both sides for me. I'm like, why are you sitting there with your phone in the face? You know, <laughs> you know, because you, you just don't do that. You know what I'm saying? You don't do that. If you at my dough talking shit and I don't know you, my phone might be in your face. If I, if you my wife and we had sitting here going over this shit and you got the phone in the face, I can't take you serious. I can't take him serious because he's sitting there with a phone in her face doing this whole goddamn argument. And then she just dumb. They I don't I don't know what the fuck they I don't know what 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 was going on with them. How they even get into this goddamn that relationship. Ain't your business to be my business. Because my stash is so how my, my money, kids, not my, you. No, that don't make sense. Okay. How my money is our money, but your money is your money. Because that's the way it is. That ain't the that's way, way it is. That ain't that, the way it is. I'm Take just gonna say this right here. She probably got, she would have got right hook right in the face. I don't give a damn who think what about it. I probably would hit that bro. That's why I have to stand way across the room if I'm in a, if I'm in an argument like this. Because when I get that kind of energy, there ain't no telling what I'm lying for. I would have reached across and touched the fuck out of her. You just caught everything I do. What you do? Everything. <laughs> I'm gonna let you think that. Oh, you let me think that. Yep. So in the meantime, job. you get paid. You got paid today. It's Friday. So in the meantime, I need you to run me some coins so I can go ahead and check out on what I'm doing and go to work. What? Go to work. What? So, and then she just asked for some money so she could. Ah! <laughs> I'm just going to skip. This is the, wait a minute, the I'm video done. almost over. I ain't got anyway. nothing else to say. I'm done like you did. Stop recording me. I'm done. I don't have nothing else to say. Simple as that. I'm done. Go to like work. I got stuff I'm done to do. like you done. I got stuff to do. I'm done, done like you done. Do. Get out of my face. Get out of my, get out of my face. And this is my life. This All right, y'all. This has been another episode of What Did I Just Watch? Far Gray Reactions. And check this video out. I want to see you and you too. You see, he said Far what we ask is, motherfucker, you didn't, the content you didn't do shit. Page. What the fuck you talking about, Far Grave Reactions? As a subscriber. You right, didn't, didn't subscribe to you for what? You didn't, you didn't do shit. You didn't. <laughs> hey, I met that guy. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, next we video, next scroll, party, man. And I was like, twins. And then I told him about this 24-7 waffle place. That's just as great as Geico's 24-7 claims. This goddamn commercial. Let me see what we got. Can't wait to see you.
<laughs> what the hell is this? I don't know what we going to see, so. The fuck is this? What is it? I can't it's even tell. It's called the Big it. Easy. <laughs> Whatever it is, so they take long. it too long. To, Did you even wash this thing? Yeah, I washed it. Yeah, let me just go into something else. All right, Chad, is that I normally don't come on the social media thing with my problems, but I felt like this was one of the problems that I need to come on social media with. So I had a homeboy that told me, hey, Teddy, bro, you ain't been on a date with a woman in about almost two years. Only reason why I don't go on dates because they don't work out for me. I told people multiple times. A lot of women have asked me, hey, take me on a date. And I genuinely say no. So he gonna have a nerve to tell me, you know, this is why you always grumpy. This is why you always got attitude. And I said, that's not true. I'm just I just a genuinely grumpy person. So I thought about what he said. I like, you know what? I haven't been on a date in two years. Let let, let me just go on a date. Long story short, I let her pick the place. It's some place called 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 Toast. If you live in Atlanta, you know you know what Toast is. It's like a little breakfast spot. You know, you got a little brunch. You know, they got good drinks and stuff like that, right? So we get to the place. We, we, we wait about 10, 15 minutes to be seated, which is normal. So when we sit down, the dude gave us the menu. Everything on this menu costs more than $25 for some eggs and some bacon and a little <laughs> couple of little potatoes. I so knew the young lady it. I that I took it. out, she was she was she looked like she can eat, you know, if you know what I mean. She looked like she can eat. Let's so see. I said, you know what? This one gonna be expensive. So let me go ahead on and make something at the house. I already have prepared, so I made something at the house just in case our bill was too high. So now it's time to order. You know, I get me just, I said just let me get a toast, let me get a toast breakfast, let me just get the eggs. Uh, with the bacon, with the potatoes, and that's it. Bring me a water and bring me a coffee. That'll be it for me, right? Yo, when I tell you when she flipped this menu over, I already knew she she about to spend some money. She about to make me get in my wallet. I know it because when she flipped the menu, that where all the drinks was at. She ain't order food yet. She asked, can I take your food order? He, she flipped the menu and started giving her drink orders. So Toast got these little fancy little drinks. With oh my goodness, man. Out I don't of her and make shit. Little, you know, she, you know, so she ordered one of them, right? So as she ordering that, and he talk more than I do. I tend to get my menu and look at it. That drink itself was $45 just because it had a little, the little fog and stuff coming out the drink. So that right there, that's when I already started calculating. Okay, that's 45 The breath is going to be another 20 something, close to 30 And I still got a tip. So in my head, I already knew this whole little, this little date, little breakfast date thing was going to be expensive. So I hit my homeboy up and I asked him, hey, bro, cash at me a hundred because I'm in a situation right now that's going to cost me more than two. So my homeboy sent me the money. Now we waiting. Now we waiting on our drinks and all this stuff. Cool. Now we waiting on the food. Now we have this, you know, small oh, talk. Hold just, up, you know, just kicking it. Hold so, up, dude. It's just, hold up. I don't know. This, this might... This shit is eight minutes long too. Fuck this video. But I'm like, okay, you out on a date with somebody. And I mean, if if you in a situation where you got to call your homeboy to cash app you $100, you don't need to be going on no dates. You need to just be your ass wherever the fuck you at. You need to be at home chilling like I'm doing right now. Yeah. <laughs> If you got to call somebody else, even like a couple of hundred dollars, if you got to call somebody else to be able to cover that, you shouldn't have been there to start with. I'm just going to skip this because he, he, it's it's three minutes now. It's five oh, whole other minutes. It's too long. Oh, my goodness. Hey, babe. What? I got a question. Why don't men approach women anymore? Why don't men approach women anymore? Yes. So we're speaking like generally. yeah just generally speaking like the overall consensus that i get so it's coming from a man coming from a man okay um men for the last generation have been subtly continually trained to not approach women hmm. and I'm, it's happened over years okay mm-hmm 
I'm and sitting I down with my legs crossed like that. Right the whole <laughs> feminist movement that impacted the aforementioned movement has made a lot of women in the West very unpleasant. I don't think women, generally speaking, not you or an individual, but generally, mm-hmm. respect the the presence of the masculine energy. If a man, so so what happened happens is over time. Women stopped being pleasant because women became less feminine. I think a feminine characteristic is to be welcoming of the masculine energy. Now that does not that does not take away from the fact that men can be A B C one two three. But we look at this one dimensionally, being that you asked. Mm-hmm. So over time, the more and more women approach women, the more and more men approach women. <sighs> The neck rolling, the lip smacking, the he's trying to talk to me, the I'm not gonna say nothing. Over time, that programs a man. So when you couple that in terms of male and female interactions publicly, grocery store, drugstore, on the streets, to where men, women aren't receptive to masculine energy, what's gonna happen? They're gonna stop talking to them. And what are men gonna do? They're gonna look elsewhere. So, this is why you see the juxtaposition between a lot of traveling men who juxtapose American women with foreign women, and they always look for the what? More feminine. So, what are they talking about? Latin America, Africa, Brazil, Thailand. Mm-hmm. Okay, now, is it that the valuation of women in the West is down? No, but I mean, that's what's happening. You get to the point to where you know, you don't even want that interaction. Like, I'm not even gonna say nothing to him. So men have been trained to do that. So voila, women were a part of that. Are women the blame? No, I'm not sitting up here saying all women are the blame, but if you are a guy and you always trying to talk to a woman and she's short, curt, don't want to talk to you, what you think is gonna happen? If you keep kicking me, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna stay away from your foot. So what's happening is men are now approaching women in a different type of way digitally it's easier to, to it's DM the same thing bro because you it's the same the thing rejection of mm-hmm. the ego it's the of same and thing. I think that if we can get to the point to where men and women respect each other if a woman if a man there never should be a reason why a man should speak to a woman and she doesn't speak back ever if he's rude if he's unkind that's a completely different i'm talking about just speaking do you know how many often that happens? So that's my answer. That's, 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 what y'all think? I know, you know, they going to say what they going to say. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to say what I'm going to say. But, you know, that whole thing, well, I don't approach women because uh, I don't have that skill. I have this thing about being in people's space uninvited. You know what I'm saying? It's just, it's one of them things. Um, if somebody start talking to me, I know how to chat up a woman just fine. But as far as me just, just out there, just you know, approaching folks, no, it, it, it don't fucking happen. I don't do that. Now online, I do that because that's just how it works. And you just bloop, 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 pop a message over, whatever. But it's the same fucking thing. I did, a, I did a video where I did this same little scroll thing, but I went through my inbox. I went through my inbox and it's the same shit that he just explained. Well, you know, well, if I'm trying to talk to you and I speak and all you and they short or curt with you or something like that, that's what my inbox is like. You know what I'm saying? I can just imagine if I now that's just in my inbox. You know, I blow that shit the fuck off. I can just imagine if that shit happened to me in real life. Well, I'm out here trying to approach women and I'm getting the same kind of reactions I do that I get in my inbox where motherfuckers is uh, short, curt, or whatever the what fuck you want to call that shit while I'm trying to talk to them and you can't get nothing but a one word reply back or some shit like that. Uh, all of that. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's the same thing. Um, I, you know, that... Uh, Nowadays, as far as I, I don't know about the, the the in real life going out and approaching people stuff, but folks be if you ain't got something in your fucking hand, 
to offer. You know what I'm saying? If you ain't just up offering whatever, uh, offering something to somebody, they ain't, they ain't trying to hear shit you got to say. Unless they, unless you just a looker. I'm not a looker anymore, so I can't use my, I can use my looks. I know how to take pictures. You see shit out of people? Don't want to spend a lot of money? I got you. Three meat, jambalaya, let's do this shit. No. A woman doesn't videos. fall in love with you when she's with you. She falls mm -hmm. in love with you when she's away from you, thinking about you. But here's where most guys mess up. You do not keep her thinking about you by constantly being around or checking in with her all the time. It's counterintuitive, but that actually pushes you out of her mind. They stop her from ever falling for you and they cause her to lose attraction. And even if she initially liked you, she'll still pull away. And that's what I love about your quiz. It not only lets them see- if I don't know what kind of goddamn quiz that is, but mistakes, looks like the wrong button. They're making any yeah, we just gonna skip that because, uh, that shit don't work for everybody. You know what I'm saying? If people start throwing these goddamn love languages and all kind of stupid shit out at you, and I ah, quality time, and ah, I heard somebody say that shit today. Quality time is my love language. Ah, I'm like, get the fuck out of here with your love language. Sucking my dick is my love language. So, you know, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> You know, that, that's what I got. That's what I got to say about that. What's my love language? Suck in my dick, motherfucker. You want to show me you love me? I'm the a-hole for refusing to pay for my stepdaughter's wedding because her real daddy is the one that's going to walk her down the aisle. So let I me saw tell that. you. And this is you guys this about thing about these reaction right? videos. She I wants saw her this real right daddy here, to walk her down the aisle. She got the whole fancy thing. Now, the, the first time I saw this video, it was just him. It didn't have this broad here with her face superimposed over the whole goddamn video. That don't need to be there. I'm pretty sure you have to put something on these videos for like fair use and all this other kind of stuff. You just can't be reposting shit unless you adding to it or something like that. But it really, it really irritates me when I'm watching a video and you got somebody face just sitting there. Just you're not contributing to the shit at all. And I'm doing this shit my goddamn self, kind of, but at least my face has not popped up on it. And I got some fucking input. A lot of times, these people don't have shit to say. What the hell is this? Don't want to be my best friend. Uh, it's a question. Listen, y'all like friends by chance? Oh, best I don't know. This is some bullshit. I'm not fucking with that. Listen. Y'all need to get y'all stupid ass <laughs> ignorant kids. For real. This shit is not cool at all. And majority of these parents know what they kids are out here doing. Y'all need to report y'all children that y'all know is out here, not going to school, riding around in these stolen vehicles, trying to take people's lives. This shit is not okay at all. I literally just pulled out of my driveway, okay? Minding my own business, coming out of my driveway. She mad. No full speed or nothing. Just pulling off slowly. Coming out of my driveway, I see way up the street to the left of me, these kids swerving left and right on both sides of the streets. I just pull over because I don't know which direction they're going in, okay? I just pull over. Something just tells me get all the way out of their way, okay? I pulled over to see which direction they're going in. They see me dodging them, okay? They watching me dodging them, turns down the block, turned down my block to come my way when they wasn't even driving in my direction. Purposely, full fucking speed, okay? Down a private, a private block, okay? Full speed. This ain't no whole open road. Did a full donut. This car almost smashed into me. I moved, jumped out the way, had to jump the. F All right, she mad. That's a thirty-minute video, so we just gonna skip that. But I don't. All right, I, man. Look, we got I the stay one away chip, from one motherfuckers. Chip, the one chip, chip. I'm trying to say, uh, I stay away from motherfuckers that do st stupid shit on the road, cause that swerving shit and all that other stuff. I live in Fifth Ward. I'm in the ghetto, so. Every once in a while, you will you will see stupid shit like that. I don't know if it's from kids or whatnot, because all these motherfuckers around here look grown as fuck. 
But you'll get motherfuckers that's swerving, swinging and banging up the fucking street. Uh, uh, you get the motherfuckers that be on the four wheelers and shit like that all, all over the street and shit. So, you you, you know, I, I understand the passivity, but uh, goddamn, that's 30 minutes. She was going at it. She pulled one of my numbers. She done got this from the store, said, man, look, I know how you like spicy food. Think that the king no, can't only handle. No, got one chip now. Think that the... The king can't handle one chip. What's one chip gonna do? <laughs> one chip challenge, 2022. Turn the tongue blue. <laughs> Let's see what's hitting Zach on. Zach is shit in there. I ain't you already know something like stupid this, for that. So I usually skip over shit like this. We're gonna see real reaction. I would have skipped it if I hadn't seen Zach on I this. Stopped. I've already came prepared. I already know what time it is, so I want to make. She's sure saying that, that, that I'm gonna need milk. Milk. I made sure I picked up extra precautions. Y'all trying to I eat hot fries. I eat hot fries. Eat, hot fries eat the goddamn chip, motherfucker. My, my son talks to this stuff video? sometime all this the time. This is a 12-minute video, dude. Come on. And he said he could do it. He was like, oh, yeah, you know. I got you. Okay. This shit, I, right, so I might not make it through this. Hold on. Let me see the book. It's fucking 12 minutes. All right. Yeah, it's got a little part here. Read it. Okay, it says, what to expect? Number one, it says tongue takeover. Number two, it says shock the senses. Number three, Surge of tears, number four, jolt to the gut, and number five, a voltage. You gonna fuck around and shit yourself, son? Um, yeah. Uh, what the fuck the is a jolt to the gut? Oh, hold on, wait. They got rules. Give me, give me, give me. Oh, yeah. rules. Rules. That sounds okay, like yeah. some shit you probably ain't supposed to be eating, motherfucker. Eat the yeah. entire chip, okay? Prove it. Show us your tongue. So he has to eat the whole chip, guys. Okay. Real peppers, real heat. Okay, listen. So it turns your tongue blue. Wait hey, man, I went to that. I went to all Hispanic high school, and they brought them little tiny okay. ass fucking peppers. Them little teeny, teeny, tiny, tiny ass peppers. And, and it was tricking motherfuckers into <laughs> eating that <laughs> shit. Wait, you fuck around and have a stroke or some shit. It says real pepper, real heat. Let me check this out. This is the chip. It comes in a little. Y'all taking too long. Is it my fault for calling CPS to come pick up some kids that I was stuck to babysit? Man, you want, I don't like do you your want face. any beautiful BBW women who are just waiting for a fit man? Then you need to download Roll Up. You can check what? out plus size singles in your area. Uh, All profiles get the fuck are fuck out of here. So I had to calm down if I can make y'all this video. Let me tell y'all what just happened. And they're not gonna educate y'all this in trucking school. This is some of the parts, like before you get in the trucking, I want you to listen to this video, all right? Before you get out there and think, oh, money, 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 listen to this video. All right, got up this morning, seen this load on the board, um, and it's paying $900 to go 200 miles. So it's paying like $4.40 or something a mile, right? Good load. Um, it's picking up at a place I already, I already done been there numerous of times, but it picked up in Charlotte, North Carolina and delivered down to uh, Charleston, South Carolina, right? Boom, good load. All right, so when I got, the appointment had to be picked up at nine and it had to be delivered by three. Perfect timing. I never book a load if I can't complete that time schedule. Yep. I never put no money on my back if I can't, if I can't be dedicated to it and give you that low at that time, I'm not putting it on my back, okay? I don't like no problems. I don't like to bother nobody. I like to just do my job and get on, all right? So the low had to be picked up at nine and delivered by three. Very doable, okay? So got to the place and I found this load at 7 a.m. this morning. Soon as I found the low, I was already ready to hit the door and I was, I was out. I made it to the place at 9 o'clock a.m. this morning. Got there. And I sat at that dog. And I'm going to tell you how long I sat there. I sat at that dog until 11.35. What? I, let, I left there at 11.35. All right? So I sat there for two and a half hours at the dog. Getting loaded. Full trailer. Fine. Okay? But in the mix of me sitting there, when my time started weighing down on my delivery, I started communicating to that broker. Hey, it's cutting down. Like, hey, they saying I ain't going to get there to about 1.30. Okay? Saying I ain't going to get there to about 2 o'clock. Saying I ain't going to get there to about 2.30. You okay? Now we're saying I'm going to get there right at 3. Now we got a problem. Okay? communicated to the broker the broker said okay every time i said something to him he was communicating to the customer 
Let them know, like, hey, my driver's still at the stop. I'm being tracked and everything, right? All the communication was very clear. So, before I pulled out from that location in Charlotte, North Carolina, I asked the broker, I said, are we good to go? Like, because it's saying that I'm going, I'm going to be getting there at 3, so that adds on about 30 minutes to an hour for traffic, getting weighed, and fuel, okay? So, he said, yeah, they said we good, all right? So I gave him my ETA. I kept giving ETA. I'm giving you a 30 minute e ETA in increment. Increment. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm trying to say. Now, <laughs> to let you know, hey, look, I'm running late. Man, the, the, the broker said we fine. He done talked to him. We good. So stopped and got fuel. I stopped and got weighed. I used the bathroom. Hit the road. I pulled over two more times to use the bathroom because y'all already know I'm a woman. I drink, drink, and I drink my water and stuff. And it was a simple, like, five-minute break, five minutes. <coughs> One time it was, like, three minutes. <coughs> but that's it. Two bathroom breaks. Five minutes to three minutes. That's it. All right? And the five minutes to grab me a snack. Got on the road. Got the snack, to oh, this facility in the truck. at four o'clock on the dot. I let him, I knew I knew it by the time right, traffic, it. Come on, shit. fueling way I knew what time I was gonna get now I know how people be when on okay. my videos I'm like shit come on pulled up let me in the gate went inside the warehouse said hey where's y'all secret and receiving officer he said right here let me go get him man came back he said we're not gonna be unload you to about 11 o'clock tonight I said whoa whoa whoa, whoa. <laughs> I'm out of time like now I'm out I'm out of driving time by that time I'm out, I'm out of everything. So you ain't gonna be, if you don't get me loaded now, it ain't gonna be here by 11 o'clock. I can't move. I can't move after eight o'clock tonight. I ain't gonna be able to move. He said, well, I don't know what you're gonna do. I'm not gonna be able to get somebody even possibly get you unloaded until 11 o'clock. I said, come on, man. Come on, man, don't do this. <laughs> don't do this. They've been communicating to y'all all day. Don't do this. Don't do this. Y'all got docs here. Y'all got three docs here. Well, I cut off times at 3 o'clock. I said, my appointment went until 3 o'clock. I didn't get out of the facility until 1130 something. Okay? It said I wasn't going to get here until 3 o'clock, but that didn't accumulate the weight and everything else. This is where 43,000 pounds. So I said, sir, don't do this. Look, call your people. Call whoever you got to call. But get this truck unloaded, baby. Because I ain't going to be able to stay here until 11 o'clock. I can't move my clock. I can't move. You're going to have to get up out of here. <laughs> okay? So I said, sir. I don't want to have to show out. Come on. Do what you got to do. Come on, come on, come on. Because they've been communicating. They haven't communicated to me. We're not going to be get you unloaded. I said, well, give me a pal jack. I'll unload myself. He said, no, we can't do that. I said, come on, man. I said, I'm a, I'm a mother. I'm, try I'm trying to get back home. I'm telling you, I ain't going to be able to move my truck at until no 11 o'clock. After 8 o'clock, I'm not going to be able to move my truck. So you ain't going to be able to get this load. You don't get it today. You ain't going to be able to get this load till probably next Thursday. I work a whole nother job a couple days out of the week. <laughs> okay? So I say, either you get the load or refuse the load. Either or. But I'm not about to sit and wait on you. I'm not. I done did my job. He done, well, he hadn't communicated to me. So he ended up calling his head boss. Called his head boss. Now, it's three docks open. Three docks open. Hey, man, got a phone. I said, come on, sir. They've been communicating to y'all. Letting y'all know, look, this girl running late because of this, the place I just left. It's not my fault. It's the place I just left. The man said, you can leave the trailer there and come back. I'm 200 miles away. It's the weekend. So, you don't know nothing about truck. Oh, you can wait till after 11 o'clock. I can't move my truck at the 8 o'clock. So, how you going to get the load? So, the point of me telling y'all this, because now, now, I'm, I'm now about 30 miles away from the ship. I done left. Because I, I pissed, pissed off. I left. They gave me an option. Leave my trailer here for Lord knows who, how long. See, I'm not getting paid. I done put my money in here to get it down here. I'm not getting paid from the load because I haven't delivered the load. I'm not getting paid to move my truck back home, not get paid for that. I'm not getting paid to even buy it till back home. I'm not getting paid for that. Okay? I'm not getting paid for nothing. All because they be dicking me and they don't want to unload my truck. All right, you gonna That's get that in some of these shipping and receiving. I'm over shipping and receiving, and I have a job to do. We cannot unload you. That's not what I'm asking you to do. I'm asking you to do what was said in the email. 
Well, they didn't talk to me. They talked to somebody. They said they was going to unload me. They already see I'm being tracked. I'm not, I don't got no reason to lie to you. That stuff they're not going to tell you in trucking. They're not going to tell you that. Uh-uh. They're not going to tell you that. So, let me tell you. Piss, the, piss me off. Piss me totally off. Piss me totally off. Because, say if what? I was 500 miles away. Say if I was 500 miles away. Was I supposed to make up from that time of me got a truck on my uh, a load of, a load on my back, no money, cause now I don't use my money to get here. That I ain't get no money off this load until it get delivered. Got a load on my back, and it's stuck there all weekend. It's stuck there because I can't move my truck. I can't go nowhere at eight o'clock. And why the fuck I'm can't you go nowhere after eight o'clock? She ain't. She didn't go into detail about that. But she mad. I, I, put, I probably should have skipped that. I don't want to watch people or the kids. I don't want to see and the then kids. I said, okay. hold on. I get to skip the counter and pick my car as a gold plus. I don't want to see something like that. I told my cheating ex-wife no when she asked for a better co-parenting relationship for our daughter. Me and my ex-wife haven't spoken to each other in six years, and I thought my best revenge would be elevating without communicating. I found out that my ex-wife cheated on me because her affair partner's wife sent me all the pictures and videos that I needed to see. These are all videos and pictures that they took that were all on his phone. Some of the deal breakers for me was the fact that she did things with this person that she never would do with me. She would do it and get video of herself doing these things, but say that it was disrespectful and disgusting if I even mentioned I wanted to do any of these things. So that was like a big slap to the face. Before presenting her with the evidence that I had, I had gave her a whole chance to come clean. I had asked her straight up if she's done anything with any other men. And she told me with a straight face, never, I swear on my daughter's life that I haven't done anything with anybody other than you, the love of my life and the man that I'm married to. For you to have any thought that your wife Dude, I'm gonna need you me, to get would have the any camera. type of infidelity or any type of whim of stepping out means that our Goodness. relationship is meaningless to you and you cannot and trust this me. Shit is out of sync. Literally, as she was saying all that, my jaw was just on the floor. I was like, this is irritating to watch because this shit is out of sync. Like me? I told her if you had any integrity or respect for our relationship, our daughter, or our household, you would tell me the truth right now. And she doubled down. She had held firm that oh I was goodness. crazy and making wild 11, accusations. Damn, 11 minutes by. Let's go ahead and address this right now, honey. I'm on set and I stepped off. I don't like lip syncing. This what is All right, what do we got here? What are we looking at? Oh shit. Yeah, like, that's how women look when they take a take a piss in the woods. Looks like we have a, a mystery fourth contestant. It just look like a bunch of women that gotta take a shit. This shit don't work. It, it, I don't get the same, you know, reaction out of seeing this shit that I might have used to get back in the day. Ned just looks like a bunch of people with stomach problems trying to shake the shit out their ass. This is horrible. I'm not watching I found that. out. All right, guys. So this is from my lawyers. Um, we've been together for five years. Oh, my goodness. And I found out that she's been cheating for the last seven months. And so now what I want to do is I want to confront her and ask her if she's been cheating with me. I want her to be up front with me. If she's not, marriage is over. That's it. Done. Why wouldn't it be done any other way? All right. And why you gotta record? Why? Why? Why everybody hey, gotta hey. record shit? Yeah. You okay? Hey, so um, uh, I got a question for you. Yeah. Uh. What? Um. Don't, don't worry about it. I was just, you know, just doing something. Oh, like the TikTok or something. Yeah, yeah. It's one of those things. Um, 
<laughs> yeah, so where were you four weeks ago? Four weeks ago. Like, I don't know where the fuck I was like four weeks ago. You know, when you went on that, uh, you said you were going to uh, that place, that spot, that little food spot with Raven. Oh, yeah. Uh, the White Bull. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Raven. And then we went shopping. Were you really there? Yeah. I told you that. You sure about that? What about three weeks ago with Sarah? Three weeks ago... Oh, when we went swimming? Yeah. Yeah, I was with her too. Why are you... <laughs> yeah, why? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's why I'm like, when is she going to... Okay. <laughs> I told you this. All right, I'm all trying right. to figure out what kind of TikTok video this is. Yeah, so, yeah, so, it so is two weeks ago, it's a TikTok, you, were, all right. <laughs> you were going to that spot out uh, Dude, couple, get couple to the fucking out. point. How long is this yeah, video? Right? Two weeks. Okay. It's only four, four minutes. Weeks, so. Three weeks. So two weeks ago. Two weeks ago. Yeah, we went to the spa. That Asian spa was the okay, okay. one that I wanted to go to. It's okay. like, it's like that 24-hour one. That's enough. What? Why don't you just tell me who you're seeing? I'm not seeing anyone. Why are you asking? That's a stupid question. Who's Rick? It's your brother. I don't have a brother named Rick. Or your cousin or whatever. It's not my cousin. Why are you asking these questions? These are weird questions. Because you are cheating on me and I was trying to see if you would come forward and tell Why me like a natural person. About. Okay, so those messages you in your phone where you were saying, oh, I love you. Oh, this is the best I've ever had. Oh man, I feel sore. Why are you oh, on the phone? <laughs> <laughs> Why would you be going through my phone first of all? Like that, like don't change, don't privacy. change the subject matter. Sure. Well, don't I mean, if you ain't got the ability matter. to oh, beat it up and make it sore, then shit, son. Oh yeah. Why are you going through my phone? There's no reason to do that. Well, listen. When you go through people's stuff, you find stuff you don't want to see. Oh, so now you're gonna blame me for this then? I'm just saying you didn't need to go through my phone. Like, why are you going through my phone? And why are you stop recording? I don't have to stop recording. Oh my gosh! Like, you could just extra. stop talking while he recording. Always been insecure. You know, you know what? We're done. Done what? Like this marriage is over. What are you talking about? This is what the fuck lawyers. You're... I... Why are you really? Yeah, just. You gotta be petty like that. Why are you recording? So you're gonna gaslight me because you want you well, want to step on the yes, marriage. Five you? five years in this marriage, and all of a sudden, out of nowhere, you want to go you want to go fucking cheat. I mean, you always work on. I mean, she probably wanted to cheat from the start, so oh, and so she was probably cheating before I then. Wasn't, I wasn't cheating. I wasn't cheating. Oh, so you just slipped and fell onto his dick then, huh? You, there's no. I didn't fall onto anything. What are you talking about? There's nothing that you saw. And like I said, you shouldn't be going through people's phone. Like that's my privacy. You know what? That's my privacy. You pay for it. Get out. You, know? See, you, know what? I, I, you can't. You can't just pull people out. Where's so. the ring? Where's Where's the five hundred dollars? We're in the house. Who wears a ring in the house? Where's the Look five thousand dollars ring? Extra. Where's the six? Like, stop. You know what? Extra. Just for my lawyers. Ooh. I don't know how it's gonna turn out, but you got the evidence here. I don't like your hairline, son. <laughs> it's better than mine. I tell I'm you done. that. I'm done. See, now, this this is the same thing that was up with the other shit. It's just as petty. You know what I'm saying? If you know somebody is doing something, go up to them like a fucking adult or at least a responsible human being and talk to a motherfucker and confront them without having your goddamn phone pointing in their goddamn face. At that point, it don't matter what they fuck you did, you just as bad as they are. At least in my opinion. Because I'm like, if I if I'm if somebody come up in here accusing me of something, it don't matter what the fuck it is. And they got a and they got a phone pointing at me, I'm not talking at all. It's gonna be a one-sided conversation. Only thing they gonna do is see me. I'm either I'm sitting on my futon right now, but I'm either gonna be sitting here in front of my TV continually playing my game or watching whatever the fuck I was doing while they sit there and talk to themselves while they record me playing the goddamn game. I'm not fit to have a conversation with nobody They're sitting there record me so it can end up on some shit like this. You know what I'm saying? That's 
That's that's you know, and just I got let me get out because I don't like his face. Shave, nigga. Shave all either grow the beard out or cut it off. You don't have a face for that in between shit, son. Y'all get in here, get in here, get in here right now because I'm gonna be telling you all out about my new MJ Harris. Hold on, my phone, Jay. Hold on. Oh no, we feel to skip that. I don't know. The reason know. that a lot of places in South Jersey around this area don't make New York style pizza because they not New York motherfuckers. Rock the arrays. <laughs> These are all things. Yeah. Derek, please don't make me get, get out of the car. car. Please, can we talk about it? Please, please. Oh, just what forgive the hell? me. Let me talk about it, please. Ryan, you sure she cheated? Bro, I heard everything she was saying. No, uh, he's man. lying. All right, grab right back. Okay. Brown sugar and flour. I got it. Okay. What the hell? Is this one of them setup things or is this real? I can't read the shit that's going on on the goddamn screen, goddammit. Hey. I can talk for like literally five minutes. Oh, man, get the fuck out of here. Nothing you just want in the store right now, so. So, really, you couldn't like just. Picture? <laughs> yeah, this ain't. This is bullshit. Uh oh. Damn it, I fucked off and clicked on the wrong shit. All right, now I gotta find a whole new video to. to Test left. Scroll down. That was bullshit. That was some bullshit. That was some setup shit. I don't know what the fuck y'all doing. I don't know what that it's is. It's officially story time. Most of you guys already know when I was in New York City, I got locked up on the way home at the airport. And I'm going to tell you exactly what happened. But I have to start from when I went to Nashville a couple months ago. That way everything makes sense. So follow me. Everywhere I go to, everywhere I fly, I always carry my weapon. My weapon meaning my firearm. Oh, Good. yeah. We just going to skip over. The last time? This got to be the last time. Okay, like two more times in this. Uh, what? Hey, what's up? What's up? I'm good. Just had to drop off the money for the baby. Oh, the baby or for me? I mean, it's for both of y'all, but you know, it's for the baby. So you need to yeah, that's some bullshit. Skip that. So you got no, a woman. I, I don't like watching skits. I watch the yeah. real shit. I don't like skits. Once I figure out it's a skit, I'll My skip. My husband is in the shower right now, right? And he just got a text message to his phone. Talking about can't wait to see him, right? I'm on my way to the location, right? So it says Lisa, and my thing is, I just know Marcus was is he's not stupid enough to be cheating on me. Like there's no way that he's cheating on me, y'all. Like y'all know we just had Junior six months ago. That don't mean and nothing. And we got like the house, everything, everything that we have. So I'm just like not letting myself believe it. I don't. I don't well, know none of that for mean sure nothing. what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna text his phone, right? And I'm gonna say, on the way. And, um, I'm gonna go to this location. I'm gonna go to this location that that this number sent. Just to make sure for, you know what I'm saying? For me, for my family. This sound like some You know, dumb my shit. two kids, three years we've been together. Like, I'm gonna make sure. I just wanna make sure. I just hope not, but I'm gonna make sure. Like, it's definitely something that today. We're gonna find out. We're gonna find out today. It's like, for real. Hey, babe. Baby. Yes, babe. Sure, you bring my phone? Yeah. I can bring your phone. Hey, babe. What's up, baby? You alright? Yeah. yeah. I'm cool. I'm getting, getting. Why motherfuckers getting don't have a screen lock on, on their phone? Well, you know what I'm saying? I, mean, I live in a house I by myself. And I always got to unlock right, my phone. You got somewhere to be? No, I got a few hours to run. Okay. Okay, right. Well, I got somewhere to go. I'm going to get something to eat. Are right, you, you good? I, I bet. All right, I'll be back. This nigga got the nerve to be in there, damn. Grooming his she face remind his me of somebody I know. My nerves. I cannot if they wasn't a crackhead, let and I'm not me being mean. Out. You let me find out. You know, you know that one person that's really though. bad off. I swear to God, but if they was when like normal, back, they would be I all right. Back, I'm gonna snatch all the hair out of his beard. I'm not playing with him. Like I'm not playing with him. Why I'm taking my kids and man. I'm leaving. I'm taking my kids and I'm out. Let me find out. Let me find out. I promise y'all, watch. Watch this. This is going to be some dumb shit. And we out of here. There's too much going on with this right here. This is like some. Wait, he got the audacity to 
audacity. You know what I'm saying? I'm not playing with him. This? I'm not playing with him. This I'm on man, the way. it's fucking 12 minutes. I ain't got time for this shit. And then we got waffles. Oh. I'm gonna have to start checking the time beforehand. This, this dude here, believe, man. Nah, this fucking dude here with his old nun from coming nah. last. <laughs> I'm on Instagram. <laughs> See, man, y'all gotta stop with these filters, Instagram, man. Y'all gotta stop, cause she don't look nothing like what the Instagram, what the Instagram pictures and videos look like. I get him. Take it. No. Take no, it away. No. No, you can't tell me what to do. Okay, record me. You in my car. Record. record you in my car. Me. Yeah, I'm going to record you. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to record Get you. Out the Yo, cat, car. You're catfishing. Mm -hmm. That's what they call it. It's a word for it. No, I'm not. Yes, you is. No, I'm not. You look like your pictures. Uh, I look like my pictures. No, you different. don't. I just didn't wear makeup. No, no. Don't you do not up. look like your pictures. Whatever. You do not look nothing like your pictures. And you catfished me. Mm. And what I'm doing. I'm gonna show the I'm gonna show the whole world who you really is. Please I'm like, do. yeah, I'm who the fuck out of it. This some bullshit. Like, you go sit there. Yeah, she African too, so I don't know. You know, I don't, I don't know nothing about them African chicks, but but you go sit there with your phone in somebody's face, recording them, holler about they catfishing her, and she just go sit there. Like, get the fuck out of here, Doctor Farrell, whatever the fuck your name is. Get the fuck out. Fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. That phone would be halfway up your ass. Fuck around with some of the women I know. Call your <laughs> It's funny. All this goddamn shit. Motherfuckers be sitting there with the phone ahead. Ain't ain't none of these women on here because apparently I ain't gonna say it ain't happen, but apparently these are just the women that don't snatch the phone and no shit like that. Because I'm a hundred percent sure that a lot of times you hop your ass up in there talking shit to somebody with your phone in their face. That phone getting snatched. That phone getting snatched, and your little iPhone or whatever the fuck you got for to go flying across the goddamn room. <laughs> it's for to go flying across the goddamn room. We in a car. She he, he gotta be sitting he right next to this motherfucker, man. Get the fuck Please, out of here. Lady. You a I'm good a, lady. I'm a fuck you with it whatever way you want to no, do with it. No, no. And you didn't tell me you were from no other country or nothing. Look how you talking. Look how you talking. What do you expect? What you mean what, what I you expect? When you saw my name, you didn't know I was Nigerian? No. You didn't know where I came from? No. Oh, no. But I, oh, well, I, yes, I, you did. No, I didn't. Oh. I guarantee you I ain't know you. I, you, I know you don't look like picture. I look like my picture. No, no. I do. No, you don't. Yes. You need to Ain't take nobody them down, stop catfishing me and like me and waste their time. You. I didn't catfish you at all. You this know what happened? You saw it too. You a lie. You know I look I exactly like no, my name. Your, look at... your happy smells, your clothes smells. Tell me what was it? My, my clothes what smell like it and Dior. It smells Dior. bad. It smells like, Shoot, smell like it, yeah, if it smells bad, that's because you got in here with your will. Yeah, I want you. Go out on dates with folk. That How dude sound about dumb as all our does. They, they both stupid. Come on, let me so see. So I want y'all to hear the story of our brother here. He went to the doctor and found out something about his particular situation. Yeah, I'll, with yeah, it. I'm, yeah, whatever. Artificial intelligence. What the fuck? Let me see. I'm going to do one more if it ain't, if it ain't long. Hey, beautiful this love. Is a whole I, I, was, hour. I was. Sorry, baby. Sorry, baby. It's a whole hour long video. I ain't got time. Just to know I'm out here management out here too all because Gibbs Truth came out here last night eight minutes they came out here cleaning this morning all because of me remember that respect me respect my name Gibbs Truth no lie okay yes okay well we nah nah yo it ain't serious yo yo that's yo, I don't that's, know what the fuck that look, is every freaking day my baby mama come by here with one thing of food, one meal with, for my child. But I got three other kids now. We got one kid together, but she only want to come around and bring one thing of McDonald's. Why the fuck she gotta feed though? all your kids? How come you can't feed my other kids though with some McDonald's? I mean, that's bogus as hell, yo. This sound not, whack. Get the man. fuck out of here. That well, sounds just stupid. She leaves a man because she wants to teach this guy a lesson. She, she probably gonna come back. There's a chance anyway. 
But when a woman leaves a man, why your mouth herself, and your shirt the same color? A man <laughs> because she's trying to restore her peace. When a woman leaves that is a distracting man to restore back to the best version of herself that she was without that man, or because she knows that's what she can become without that man, she ain't coming back. Ain't this she one ain't of the dudes back. that had the these crazy videos thing and is, he was cheating on his woman and shit? Understand that. Yeah, we're going to skip you. Your shirt and your mouth match, and it's distracting. All right, what the fuck happened here? How long is this video? 25 minutes. Sorry, baby, too long. Yeah, she think I'm stupid. Came home. You probably early. are. I didn't go to work today. Three minutes. Husband didn't go to work, Coming and you just day. happened to knowingly Make come home day. and somebody gonna be in the house. Get the fuck out of here. Nobody playing no game. I know something. This got TikTok on it, so that's probably some bullshit. Motherfuckers be sitting here drawing up these goddamn skits. Yeah, WD-40, motherfucker. <laughs> That's the same thing I be saying. You try to sneak around and the damn doors be creaking. Old ass house. Well, my house is old. But yeah, you gotta. Dude, you jingling your keys, bro. Probably in the bathroom taking a shit. Ain't no damn clock. Oh no. Hell no. Yeah, I'm talking about. I know it's something. Every time I leave the goddamn house, she leave the goddamn house. Why the fuck she gotta stay in the house? Hey, baby, where you at? Oh, yeah, home? Oh, okay, I was wondering where you was. I was trying to figure it out. Because you weren't answering the phone, really. I was trying to see what was going on. Yeah. Oh, no, I was just calling, baby. You say you're at home. Don't worry about it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay, well, uh, shit. I'm uh, finna get off. I ain't gonna go to work. I don't feel good today. Yeah, I don't feel good today. So uh, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna come on home. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, uh, I, uh, shit. Now you got any plans today? Yeah. Yeah, I said I don't feel good, so I'm gonna just come on home. I'm finna get ready to come home. I need to know what's, you know, I, I need to know what's the plan. You know, if you do anything. Do you see you at home, baby? Yeah. Okay, okay, well, I'll be home. Uh, God damn it, come on. Uh, Conclude this right shit. Right now, I'm about a job, so it's gonna take me about. About 30 minutes to go, so. Like, motherfucker can't hear the like, echoes and shit when you're talking. The time of when I come home. Bro, I done been in the game. I'm I know all the kind of shit you gotta watch out for. Yeah. Sound like you're sound like somewhere else, but anyway. See? All right, <laughs> well, I'll meet you when you get to the house. <laughs> all right. Bye. Bye, motherfucker, boy. Wait till her ass get here. Ooh. See, that was that was pointless. You see these nine tablets of 100 milligrams of Denafil? Yeah, well, that shit don't do it. So, listen to this. I made a video yesterday it's five minutes. talking about how people view us as truckers when we go to these warehouses. Ah, uh, don't want more trucking shit. I'm so sick Thanks of trucks. Question. Uh oh. Yeah. Why my son? <laughs> the face is pixeled out. This got to be some real shit right here. My son keep coming to me telling me that you four minutes than the rest of the kids. Cause he is different than the rest of the kids. He's How? My son. Goddamn. He's not your the son. Fuck? He's my son. Right. 
So, so you should be your... treating him like your son too. No, he's it's not, not her son. son. He does not belong to me. Your so, ref, it's, it's your responsibility to take care of your son. I don't expect for my kid. I don't. There's nobody taking care of my kids other than me. Talking about they're your kids. So yes, you take care of so, so, our kids together, and you take care of your son. But you don't take care of my son. You don't treat my son like like he family, he like he here, part of our he family. Be here. I mean, he don't go without. He be here. He live here. Kids. He go with his mother okay. occasionally. What are you okay. talking about? Okay, but he's also not my son. Like, what do you want me to do? That's not my child. You want me to sit around and treat him the exact same as I treat my children? He's yes, not my child. He's I do. Man, they different. just mixing the pixels and all kind of shit. The whole face he showing. He's at home when he comes to his dad's house. I'm not his mother. The pixels are just missing. You're not his, his, mother. Mother. You. You're not his you mother, but you my girl at the end of the day. Right. So you should, you're supposed to be really? treating my That's son. Of son. Course. Look, look at it. Look at what she got on. Like look at the earrings and look at that hair. You don't and look at the rest of it. You, 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 you might as well be doing that. Not she got okay. bad judgment all over her. First of, all, first of all, your son is bad. I don't know what kind of training he got. She got green. It may have to have something to do with that ragged baby mama you got. But it's not. That's not what I'm talking about. At the end of the day, this don't got nothing to do with my baby mother. This don't got nothing to do with nothing else but you treating my son differently from the rest of the kids. Your son is different than the rest of the children. He's not my son. Like I told you that. I told you that from listen, jump. I told it, you listen, that from if jump. you don't, if you don't start treating my kids, I told you that from jump. I told you that from jump that your child, I will. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna be here. I'm gonna make sure he's straight. Like in, in regards to he's not Shut gonna hurt that. himself or get hurt, but. I also told you, you can't expect me to step up and be a mom to somebody that's not mine. I told you that. I don't think I have that capability. We had that conversation. If this was vice versa, I would be treating your daughter accordingly. But you don't have to. You don't have to because I didn't come to you with no outside children. I didn't come, wow. with, I didn't come with you with them straight. I didn't come with you with that. Wow. But Did you, I? But Did you, I? But you, Did but, I put but, you in that but situation? At the end of the day, at the end of the day you decided to stay with me and you knew I had a kid. You decide to stay right. with Right, and so you should step up and take care of that extra whatever. Wow. That's on you. Wow. That's not on me. You don't think that's a little, just a little bit child? So you telling me if bit? I, so you telling me I have a baby, I bring the baby home, you gonna take care of it and be a father? If you had the kid before me and I, we get in a relationship, why wouldn't I? That don't make sense not to. I wouldn't expect you to. I wouldn't put that all on you. If you did that, that was up to you. But I wouldn't put that on you. That's a lot to put wow. on my shoulders. Look what you want me to do? Y'all look at this. This All makes right, sense to y'all. Look at it. Look at it. Do it make sense? I mean, we've been we've been together how long? If you had a kid already, now it's and, a problem. I, and then me and you had so two kids, something? and now then it's the you issue. Bro nobody had to say nothing to me. It was so my son who said so. Okay, right. I can see this. So he's upset because what he didn't get a piece of candy. Little bad time out when the other kids got to play. What's what happened? No, what, my what, son is upset what's because he, he said what he that said. you was giving the other kids stuff, uh -huh. candy, uh -huh. juice, uh -huh. snacks, uh -huh. taking them outside. Uh -huh. All that he, he made my get, son that sit he in the house get because he did decide because he be running around here like he don't have no sister. Don't want to listen. To oh, the kids we because got I'm already ain't mother. bad. So when I tell him stuff, he knows I'm not his mother. When I tell him stuff, he don't listen. So because he don't listen, guess what he don't get? The say everybody else get. And guess what I'm not gonna do? Enforce nothing because he, that's not my child. So now I'm in a position to where all I gotta do is tell him to sit in the house, let the kids do whatever they wanna do, and wait till home because you're his father. He's not gonna listen to me and I'm not sure. going back and forth with you about so this. Have a conversation with your son. Maybe if you got your son to listen. What's right. you talking about? Right, okay. And? My son is only gonna- Our three-year-old listens. What are you saying? <laughs> what, what's your point? What's your you, point? You, you, you just Our three unreasonable. Our three Get the pixels right, man. You're not even reasoning about you something that's logical. I done seen this woman's whole face. It ain't no use for that being mother. there. Do you see? Look okay. at that. So that's the point. So you're feeling like you're not his mother. You figure it out. You figure out how to fix that. I've been looking at the cleavage the whole time anyway, so. That, that's that's pretty much it. All right, we'll get your son to listen, and we'll see. We'll, we'll go from there. Get my son to get listen. Get your son to listen, and we'll go from there. Listen, I... Exactly. So, are we done? Yeah. Yeah, because I'm like this. I'm on her side when it comes to this shit. That's not my goddamn kid. You know, in general, you get the same treatment as everybody goddamn else. But if you got kids of your own and it's another kid there, and that one kid is not respecting you the same as your your own kids is because they know you're not their biological mother. Then yeah, you gonna be ostracized, motherfucker. I'm like that. I'm not gonna sit there and, and fuck with you like that. 
I can't treat you like my kids because you not. Cause my kids get smacked across the goddamn head. I tell you that all day. But somebody else's, even if we in a relationship, that's somebody else's goddamn kid. I can't go smacking somebody and then somebody else, baby mama, a biological mama show up, want to have some shit, all kind of other. Hey, man, look. And then we on this shit again. You just as bad as however the bad, uh, however wrong you think she is about confronting her with a phone in her face recording this shit. You're going to always be wrong for that. Always. If you don't own your future, somebody else is going to right now. Yeah, whatever. Oh, mommy. Mommy. Blake, stand up. Mommy. All right, son, just wait one second. The fuck is you doing? I wait. can't. I said wait. I'm going to tell you that I told you I can't even read. I can't believe this. What? And you're going to learn today. Uh-oh. This is 30 that. minutes. Close. We can't even get into that. This is a 30 minute video. Room. Let's talk about it, honey. Let's talk about it. Not Let's for no 44 um, minutes. I don't know if I've just been living under a rock, but I had no idea that I apparently have several 401k accounts just out there in the well, oh, well, I'm going to need you like to be I more said, well. that's all I had. I didn't know you was charging me that much. You knew, you knew what it was. You knew what it was before you came here. No, but the thing of it is, you're trying to charge me too. So I gave no, you what I had. I'm trying to charge you too much. And I only got 150 though, Shy. That's the thing. 150? Well, 150? if you knew, what the fuck hey, folks will try to get shit? you. So what I supposed to do? Because you done did my hair. I put water all on my head. And maybe you can go get the other 100. I, I'm not finna take my hair off that you just did. What I look like? Let you take my hair off over 100 off. You're definitely finna take it off. I'm not finna take my wig off. Oh, yes, the fuck you are. No, I could definitely probably bring it back to you, but I'm no. definitely not gonna let you take my hat off. Well, baby, you finna do something, cause ain't nobody going out of here without my hundred dollars. Oh, I'm leaving. I'm oh. definitely not gonna go out of here without my hundred dollars. Girl, I'm leaving. Mom, Lock your ass you right the fuck up in. Out here without, without my hundred dollars, baby. I'm leaving. That's what you got to do. I don't care about you saying I got you online. I got you online, and I'm finna go. No, just go ahead and no, let me go. No, ain't nobody going nowhere. I don't care about you being on live. Yeah, I'm on live because I want them to know how you doing. Because if you touch my hair, if you touch my hair, you ain't finna pay for that hair. That shit don't belong to you. Give me my 150 back. Just give me my 150 back. I don't smoke crack. Give me my 150 back. I don't smoke crack on Wednesdays. The hell? No, my cash. Well, this is on Wednesdays. No, I didn't know you was charging all of that. No, I did not. Okay, well let me out. Let me out. No, let me out. No, I will post the message. Girl, go ahead. Oh, she do all of this online, y'all. I'm putting you on live. She knew how much I charged. She knew how much I charged for. She got here, so damn all of that. Cause I don't care. I don't care. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? What you gonna do? I have what I have. Okay, okay. I got you on live. I got you on live. It's okay, but you need to move. Well, you need to move. Live, I'm live no, you owe me a hundred dollars. Live, no, you owe me a hundred dollars. That you ain't gonna get. <laughs> that, that you ain't gonna get. Honey, but like I said, I'm gonna go. Yeah, you wouldn't leave up out of there. She gonna try to tell me, tell me I got to pay her no, another hundred dollars. No, you this, told me one thing. This is how bitches get their ass whooped. You told me one thing. This is how motherfuckers okay, get beat the fuck up. At the end of the day. I ain't got it. So what? What? what what's next? Get show. What's next? Get the rest of it. That's what that means. Uh -huh. Okay. Get I got the. the I got to leave to go get the rest, the rest of it. Of it. I got you to leave to go get the. Uh, I'm not taking my wig off. Girl, you got me fucked up. Baby, you can take that off. Oh, I am. You can take that off. I can get my motherfucking money. I'm not finna sit here and argue with you. Just let me out. You already arguing with her. I don't care about you calling your cousins, you your sisters, none of them. I don't I care. Never, I ain't never, anybody know me, no, I ain't never had to call nobody. Listen, give me the rest of my money. I gave you what I had. I gave you what I had. Well, you got more. See, that's, that, see. I ain't got no more. See, people you like that, you can't do nothing. You, 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 you can't help but beat that ass. That's the no, only I'm reason, that's the only no, way you're going to teach no, them anything. No, I'm trying to leave. No, no, I'm trying to leave. No, sure ain't. Sure ain't. That's all right, because I got it all on camera, baby. I got it all on camera. Well, I would tear this shop up. I would tear this shop up in here, baby. Girl, please. 
You don't want me to get out of here in a minute because I'm going to tear this shop up. But once you get the spinning, you better spin for more of us because I want my money. What money? What money, Sean? What book. money do I owe you? I gave you? What money that I gave you? You ain't got to keep putting it on my bald head, baby. I'm going to You ain't got to keep putting it on. I don't got no wig on. You ain't got to keep putting it on my bald head. Girl. Just give me my money. Get that motherfucking camera off. Oh, shit. It would, it's not even fucking... Oh, I wanted to see somebody get that. You're not going to hey, see nobody get that ass one, but... As y'all can see, I'm up inside the hotel, right? This is the strap right in Las Vegas. My girl was saying that she was coming out here with a business trip, you know what I'm saying? But I wanted to surprise her, you know what I'm saying? Because you know, that's what I'm trying to do, man. Trying to make the relationship stronger. You know, I want to surprise her to But I got these cups right here, as y'all can see. These motherfuckers be trying to get their space away from motherfuckers. All to get the study ones. So I came down here and they got the, the Starbucks cup. And these are the ones with the ULV. I'll show them to you in a minute. Dude. Hurry the fuck up. I supposed to be in a stop recording a long time ago. It's supposed to be right here. So we about to go over here right now. Let's see what's going on. Damn, it's fucking the door's open. Yeah, this is some bullshit. Because first of all, the door wouldn't be open. You wouldn't have a key to our room to start with. Hello? Babe. Babe. Hey, babe, what you doing here? Oh, look what I got you, baby. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Hold on, let me get my, um, my stuff in there. We can go downstairs. What you, what you mean? Can oh. I take that off real quick? No, hold on. Why you, no, nah, what you doing? Nothing. Who was in the shower? I just, I was getting out just nah, now. No, hold up. No, fuck this shit. What? Who's, hey, who's, nah, who's in the shower, bro? There's nobody in the shower. No, no, no. Who's, 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 nah, ain't gonna miss me nothing. Hold on, hold on. Who's in the shower? <laughs> You about to go in there and see because some big like Mandingo dick and you're going to be mad. Let me go in this room and see what's It ain't no let me, nigga. You already in there. Go, shit. What is the problem? Let me see. What the f... Your clothes. You in here getting... I'm getting dressed. What's all this? You got alcohol. You put the business trip. Who the hell in Vegas that don't have alcohol? I, ooh, there's some men draws right there. Is these, bro? Uh, no, you need to tell me right. There's the some fuck big now. ass draws. You who might want to get up out these? that room. And who in the fucking shower? There's nobody in the shower. Michelle, I'm telling you. Listen, you better tell me there's who's in the shower. In the shower. I told you, you know what yeah, I'm this is too much. Face, this right? is too much going so, on. So, 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 wait, so you, he got his. Attorney for men cologne. Who the hell got that shit set out cologne? like that? Who, who, you know, who the hell the got the shit just 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 set out like that in order? Let me tell you. Listen, ain't no okay, telling me nothing. Back. You better tell me who's in the okay. shower. Who the hell neatly pla lays their drawers out you know, on the listen, bed what's like going that? On, bro? Listen to me. Nah, ain't no you listen to me nothing, me. man. Move, man. Move, man. I said, let me say, I'm telling you, better let me know who's in the shower. Whose shoes is them? I'm about to tell you, okay? What, what size the? is them shoes? Yo, can, move. Can, can if they like I size 14, you better run. No, ain't no, ain't better no better tell run. me nothing, man. So listen, listen. last night. Last, last night, night what? Last Who the night, fuck is in the shower, bro? Stop. Who's in the shower? Okay, so last night. What happened? You should be able to just open the goddamn door. I'm, I'm, okay. We if you want to open uh, that door, you could have been open that door. We don't know where his room is or anything, so I let him sleep on the sofa over there. Are you serious? With us, we can't just leave him out of Oh, he so he's in here taking a shower he's right now? He's taking a shower, he's getting dressed, he's leaving. You better move, move out, move out the way. Move, 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 no, out no, move out the way. Move out, out the way. Move out the way. No, ain't no, ain't no leave him alone, nothing. Right, I'll get my shoes and stuff and we can go. Let's nah, go. nah, nah, nah. I'm gonna sit right here and wait for this nigga to come out the shower. He gotta explain himself. You got me bent. I'm gonna sit right here and explain himself. Cause he gotta explain why the why hell you keep looking at his drawers. drawers. I don't want to look at that on dude the on bed like now. Nah. No, nah, I don't give a damn. Uh oh, I hit the button. Sorry. Hey, what's going on, y'all? As I can see, I'm up inside the hotel. Right? Oh, that was this some bullshit. Right Wait a minute, hold up. Hold up. Because it was only that, it was only three minutes long. This, three minutes long. this is one of them skits. Ain't, ain't shit happen. That's Who the fuck is in the shower, bro? Yeah, it would, it, this Who's is some in the shower shit. Last night. Yeah, what? you don't be knowing what's uh, what and shit on here. Not me, no, no. When the door was unlocked, I knew it was some bullshit. No, not me. This Karen.
Karen is about to get her. Yeah, <laughs> Karen. They just start calling people Karen. Video. Anyway, Karen. that's all the scrolling I'm gonna do Towards for the day. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to go through. Uh, Check this video. I'm gonna have to go through another. Um, another um, scrolling video, and I might have to click on a different type of video. This started on a football video, so I don't, I don't know how you get certain shit. Game. This is a Brock Lesnar. And as we said, Brock we'll Lesnar football you video. I didn't, even, I didn't even know this dude would even play football. But in apparently, there he was for, playing but, football for a little bit. Will be his no first while. official tackle. But anyway, uh, oh, this nasty ass video right here. Everybody was capping on this video. You can't put shit online. They were capping on your shit. You can see how to make rose shaped scrambled eggs. Everybody, everybody was capping on this goddamn uh, on these scrambled eggs. I. Yeah, everybody was like, bro, you got to cook them eggs. <laughs> everybody in the comments, usually when you see shit in the comments and you know it's a bunch of white folks in there and, and shit, you know, everybody like they food a little bit different and shit like that. But that was the first time I looked at the video and, and everybody was like, bro, them eggs ain't cooked. I like, they'd be like, man, I, I like my eggs actually cooked. And then somebody else actually said those weren't scrambled eggs. It's some kind of omelet, but you know, it is what it is. But I was the same thing. I was like, but now nah, I, nah, you gotta cook them eggs. Them eggs ain't, uh, that shit ain't right. <laughs> anyway, uh, like I said, um, hopefully the next time I do a, a let's, a let's scroll video, uh, it won't be, uh, all this cheating shit. But like I say, it's all fucking random. I don't know what the fuck I'm going to run across. So until next time, I will catch y'all on the flip side.